डॉक्टर सचमित पात्रा जी श्री विश्वंबर प्रसाद निषाद श्री विश्वंबर प्रसाद निषाद नॉट प्रेजेंट श्री पी विल्सन श्री पी विल्सन नॉट प्रेजेंट श्री वी विजय साई रेड्डी प्लीज थैंक यू डिप्यूटी चेयरमैन सर आई ऑन बिहाफ ऑफ माई पार्टी स्टैंड टू रेज दी स्टैंड टू सपोर्ट दिस बिल सर आई कुड ऑब्जर्व सेवरल पॉजिटिव एस्पेक्ट्स इन दिस बिल एंड थ्री ऑफ द पॉजिटिव आई वुड लाइक टू हाईलाइट एंड ब्रिंग इट टू यूर काइंड नोटिस सर दिस ट्रिबल आई टी ट्रिबल आई आई टी टू अट्रैक्ट यन ऑफ स्टूडेंट्स रिक्वायर्ड टू डेवलप ए स्ट्रांग रिसर्च बेस इन द फील्ड ऑफ इंफॉर्मेशन टेक्नोलॉजी ऑफ इंडिया सो इट्स वन ऑफ द पॉजिटिव एस्पेक्ट सर एंड सेकेंडली with youth being the future of india more institutes of national importance increases the prospects of getting jobs because iits and triple iits are considered to be uh, institutes of uh, uh, par excellence since provisional certificates that have been granted earlier in respect of the, these institutes which the honorable minister now uh, making them as institutes of national importance they got this early the, these provisional uh, certificates and not degrees these are all the provisional certificates earlier they got earlier from these institutes served as an impediment for them in getting jobs and several organizations and this problem would be solved now sir uh, nationally recognized triple its in india could also make it a hub for foreign nationals to come to india and then as their intended stop to study in india so that this more foreign students will come to india for study sir i have few suggestions to be made to the honorable minister sri prokriyal ji sir andhra has got only in fact the uh, minister has pointed out in his speech that andhra pradesh has got only one triple i triple iit uh, in ppp model in chittur sir i urge the government honorable minister to build another triple iit in visakhapatnam visakhapatnam being the executive capital proposed executive capital and most populated city in andhra pradesh would be an ideal location in terms of uh, number of enrollment of students sir sir uh, another suggestion apart from just giving uh, institutes uh, giving national importance to this ins new institutes of the government i request the honorable minister to focus on the existing ones also because for instance i'll give for instance an example iim visakhapatnam was set up by the ministry of hrd in 2015 and till now there is no adequate infrastructure for uh, iim visakhapatnam and operates from the makeshift array, uh, uh, campus in andhra university similarly central university in anantapur uh, has also uh, uh, suffering from is also suffering from lack of infrastructure and has problems of infrastructure sir uh, the third point third third suggestion which i would like to bring to the notice of the honorable minister while see the, this particular bill when it was introduced in lok sabha it was envisaged that the bill would help to meet the needs of technical manpower by increasing the pool of trained personnel uh, coming out of these institutes that was the objective that was that that is what it was envisaged i would like to ask the government uh, as uh, as to on how it plans to hold the skilled manpower in india because many many students who have passed out of the examinations in these institutions are migrating to ab uh, uh, abroad other countries and then serving there in that country so how to hold the skilled manpower in india and the plan is to be worked out accordingly sir are there are there any changes that they propose in the job market for few more people choosing in india as their place of work instead of other countries sir uh, the last suggestion i would like to make is there need there needs to be a shift in the prospective per perspective in which we see the iits there is a perspective sir in fact i triple iits are considered to be uh, uh, a reasonably good institutes however they are often considered to be sub par to the iit and iit iits are considered to be superior than triple iits sir students uh, majority of the students choose later that is I, iits 
due to um, due to quality of education it boosts and image it has got sir there does the some measures such as standardization of the courses uh, the taught in these triple ITs and setting up the standards uh, for faculty of these institutes must be considered to attract the maximum students and to treat uh, for these triple ITs to be treated on par with IITs sir thank you very much sir with these suggestions uh, for the government i support this bill thank you vijay sai reddy ji sri ramchand prasad singh ji धन्यवाद